All right. I think we're back, coming back live. <laughs> it probably does. Uh, let me know if we're back up in a minute. Up, oh, it's going back to unstable. My my internet connection is going up and down like crazy. It's not the PC, I don't think. On and off. Well, I have saved. We'll jump in the game. We're working on it. I'm not doing any downloads. Uh, I'm not doing anything but no telling what other people are doing in the house. <laughs> yeah, you guys are, it is lagging way behind what I'm doing. The screen you are staring at is... not what I am looking at. And I just restarted, but it's having a hard time connecting. I'm going to close down a few things. We're working on it. I don't know if you can hear me. All right, uh, you are still, what I am seeing is a little bit behind me, but might be good enough to, uh, yeah, all right, yep, it's back, it says excellent now. Man, Twitch. Bit rate is back to excellent. <laughs> Big Daddy, behave yourself out there. You didn't miss much, just a loading screen. <laughs> Gonna test out the new trigger. See if I messed everything up. I get a little distracted when I'm streaming on this stuff and trying to get everything going. And eating cookies at the same time. Come on, start button. There we go. Control 8. Come on. Give me some love. Unload. Thank you. Um... Well, at least it says unload. 
let me get out of the trigger and pull in forward it gave me an unload message but it didn't let me unload come on unload it could be because I'm across the two triggers the water out snow in Diesel, Diesel Conda 83 thank you for the follow let's see if we can do it this way it's not unloading uh something's really screwy it says it's unloading but it's weird because the snow melting is having an issue because we're in the middle of summer it's like did you see that unloading I think it's because the snow is melting it's unloading it on its own you see how that's happening uh we might have to bring it into winter anyway, but let me try the shovel trigger. Let me, yeah, let's get out of let's get it out of early summer and get some real snow on the ground, because the snow melting could be causing the issue of not being filling, because it's unloading the tippers at a really slow rate. So we're gonna get it to the actual season. It'd be funny if that was the whole problem all along. But I don't think it was the only thing. More cheers from Salius. Is that it? Salius? Salius? Uh, something like it? Let me get out of the summer into winter. Get some real snow on the ground. So it stops melting in my shovels. In Quantum 4 with 10 more bits. See, gave you guys some time to watch commercials there. Midsummer. Flying right through here. We'll be there eventually. I guess we have Save Game 5. That has winter in it already, I think, but not all the equipment. You're behind me for sure. They've uh, instituted a... Why are we getting snow in the summer? Uh, delay, apparently. I have a, don't show again, quite a delay. But at least it says it's going. Yeah, it was unloading while I was driving because I think because it was uh, the season we were in. Sorry for the long delay in between the stream. Getting Trying to get rid of my change in market prices there. But He'll catch up. Yeah, it's melting in the trailer. I got to get the temperatures so the snow isn't melting in the trailers. I think that is 
the whole issue it does some type of unloading script automatically when I pull up there it says it's unloading even though it's just melting so I want to get to the proper season before I test it again snow may not be able to be melted it should be it's a fill type right but who knows what they got working on the engine back here we'll be there late autumn is flying by And into early winter. Let's get some snow. It's going to rain first. We got rain in the forecast. It doesn't look like rain. There's some snow. Let it sink up. Talk about a long sink. It could be because it's snowing that it's having a hard time sinking up. Maybe we go a little further. And we get daylight, early winter. Then we'll wait for the snow to come back. All right, our snow should draw in pretty soon. I don't know if we have any left in the trailer, but it also shouldn't be melting. See, it stopped melting. That's a plus. Let's see if that has anything to do with it. While we're waiting for it to dry in. I can't get it to offload. I'm getting it to dump, but the snow just will not offload into the stupid thing. Oh, wishes, wishes. I think we're going to end up putting a lid on this thing so we can get this map wrapped up. I hate to take it out, but I think we'll uh, see how that goes. I didn't even hit the button, and it's here. Let's dump this on the ground. It's not dumping at all. Did you guys see that? I just, oh, maybe uh, the snow mask. That's why it didn't dump there. Oh, snow mask could be interfering with the trigger let's edit our snow mask up 
there could be something here, but I'm not able to dump my snow out of this tipper anywhere. Over here, for some reason. It's stuck. There's a snow mask on the road. It's not letting me dump the snow. Uh, could it be bugged? It is dumpable. I've done it before. Let's get this shovel. But something, it could be bugged because of the, what we did. Um, I'm confused. It's not letting me dump the snow out of this tipper. Let me, uh, so that, the, the snow thing itself might be okay. Let me try the shovel trick. I don't know if we can get the shovel loaded and unloaded, but we should be able to dump snow. Unless, and the snow mask is allowing snow to fall. We're empty with the shovel right now. See, if I scoop up snow as we go through here and I pick it up, we can dump the snow back on the ground and make a nice pile. So we should be able to dump a trailer on the ground as well, unless you can't dump where snow is already. Let's test that theory out. We've got some snow. That could be the issue. If I come over here. Nope, it lets me dump it. So why is, let me see if I can dump it into this now, if this uh, loading trigger works. Shovel target looked like it worked that time. Um, well, it looked like it started working. And then looked like it stopped. I don't know if it's in there. We'll find out if there's water in there in a minute. But not getting it now. Huh. Nope, can't dump it in there. Control eight. Uh no, let's speed it up a little bit, see if this thing has anything as far as water. No, it's not even using the coal. So something's messed up. Won't let me dump in the trigger. Can dump it on the ground. Can dump it in the truck. But snow is funky stuff, so I don't know why that tipper is not letting me dump at all. It should be able to. You can see we can build a pile. It might be bugged out. Yeah, you can dump on snow too with the shovel. I'd like, to, I'm not sure why the truck see watch this see, i just put some on the but when i do the unload here it's stopping i'm getting a little bit up as i move it's going out let's see if i can get it empty but it's not piling up like it does with the shovel i got a little bit of it to empty over there Almost like it's, there we go, we got it to empty. Now the truck trailer goes up. 
let me see if that was bugged out. We'll see if we can put some back in here. I had to go over there to empty it, though. That's kind of weird. We'll do another test. Snow in tipper. Hit a tree. Snow in the truck. See how it automatically jumps to the uh, menu. I'm going to back it in from this side. I know this is a side island. Maybe the triggers are overlapping or something. I'll check them out. The water fill trigger. Yeah, I can't. I get the dump there. But what's weird is when I pull out here, I can dump a shovel anywhere. But this tipper's not dumped. Maybe I should try another tipper. It won't let me dump anywhere over here. Where did it let me dump before? Now it's stuck. 7,000 in here. Trying to get it out. And I never had that issue. can't get it to dump no clue why I got a little bit out every now and then I get a little bit it can't dump where the snow mask is but there should be no snow mask around here Yeah, I'm trying to dump on tip to ground, and it's just not tipping anywhere. Can't get it out. Kind of weird. So I guess our snow melting facility is going to get nixed for today. Sorry about that, but we'll have to. I'll save it, back it up, exit it out of the map, and uh, we'll look into it. But snow as a fill type acts kind of weird the shovel works fine but once it goes into a tipper it's kind of stuck so enough of that for today let's fix this hole over here you don't have to make an edit we're going to export this out of the map and we'll jump in and do a snow mask. Maybe trucker. Uh, where there's no snow mask, it should be able to dump. Wherever there's snow on the ground, it should be able to dump just like the shovel. Uh, I'm not going to add it this time. It was a good attempt, but we're missing something with those trailers. And there's so many things going on. So basically, it'll be in the map. But I'm going to export it out. To my desktop so we can work on it another day and then fix our snow mask i'm even going to leave the lot where it is except for the hole i'll fill in the hole
and we'll return to it on another day. We gotta do quite a bit with that crazy thing. Uh, the triggers are overlapping. Should I try that first? I just noticed that. Those two trigger, but it that could be the cause of the dumping issue. The water trigger and this trigger overlapping. Uh, I'm not going to mess. I think it isn't because they're overlapping over there at the coal thing and we got it to work fine. So, yeah, let's just export it and get the snow on the road. <laughs> oh, boy, that was bad. Export selection with files. I'm close. All right, let me export it. See if those two things overlapping. We'll do one more try. But I'm going to put it on the desktop just in case. So when we come back, we can delete it in a new folder called S N O W M E L T E R Snow Melter. We'll give it a try. Put it out there just in case. I'll separate the two triggers. The other ones were working fine. We just got to slide this one. I'm going to slide it right over to the corner so we know it's not interfering and that we're not in both triggers at the same time. And hopefully that will uh, might have some effect. We'll find out. But that'll be the last thing. And then if not, we're going to come in, fill the hole, and work on the snow mask around the things we do have working. I'm doing this just for Quantum 4. One more try. We're going to put that trigger all the way to that corner. And where'd the pipe go? Oh, it's back there. That's okay. Put that trigger right there. Oh, we can't do that. You know what? I just realized something. Our tip trigger start and ends might be off. That's a good possibility. Let me move the whole tip trigger. Because we... I don't know if I put those back, those points back in. I shouldn't have to when you move the whole tip trigger, but maybe I'm off-centered. Um, that, would, that would cause that to happen but we are getting a tip icon that's what's weird there is a snow tile factory yeah that would be good I will have to see what they did we're gonna slide this down here let me check the tip trigger start and end points. I'm just getting kind of fed up with this thing right now. It's been a long day. <laughs> Excuse me for wanting to finally get off this computer after almost 11 hours, 10 hours now going on. Uh, my start and end start is good and should be up toward us a little bit. I don't think it's going to work, but you never know. End trigger should be right here. Yep, okay. One more try. Then we'll call it a day. And I'll look into that snow factory before... Snow tile factory, if I can find it. Is it uh, pl placeable? Snow tile, that's weird. What's a snow tile, anyhow? We'll see if I can find it and see how they're doing it, what script set they're using. If it's fabric, we can steal triggers and stuff, or maybe redesign, but uh, this will be the last go at it for this. I don't. I can't think of anything else that it could be. Other than uh, trigger issues, snow needing it. 
but it's not throwing any errors. Just won't let me dump snow in. Unfortunately, we didn't save after I moved all the way to winter. So what I'm going to do is just jump in and uh, grab myself a... We've got save game five that has snow on the ground. We'll grab it, fill it, chipper, fill it up on a new save game too. Might be something with all the craziness we've been doing on that map. Maybe it has something to do with that. I believe save game five is in the middle of the winter already, if I'm correct. Yeah, so I'm going to see that's the thing. It's eight o'clock here. I'm going to jump off and I got to upload it. That's about an hour. There's nine o'clock. Get the website ready for you guys. That's 10. And then uh, go to bed. <laughs> Um, you guys are so lagging behind my stream, at least up another minute. It went back to unstable. I don't know why, perhaps. You guys are way behind. No, it's back. Maybe I was just way behind. Staring at a loading screen. There, we got some snow. We're in early spring. Don't melt snow. Ground is... Air temperature is a little warm. Oh, well. It was in a... Uh, wrong key there. Nine. Purchase myself. A... Oh, there goes the snow. Bad choice of save games. Let's go back to... The other one, we have all the equipment. I got to sign a document here anyway for my trip while we're doing this. They've been waiting for my signature. Whoa. Oh my gosh, are you kidding me? 
<laughs> Have you guys ever tried to sign an electronic document on your phone? Let me try with a stylus of a pen. Nope, has to be my fingertip. Let me, uh... <laughs> Let me try this again. Draw my signature. My finger's too fat. The box is too small. Okay. Required country USA. Don't mind me, I need to get this done today, this form, or it's for insurance on the trip, so that if I die out there, they'll bring my body back. <laughs> Departure date, return date, one slash six slash two zero one eight. And I'm back over here. Let's start that back up. Before our snow melts in early summer. We've got some snow in. It is draining, but craziness. We'll see if the trigger overlap was an issue. All right, we're going to just pull into the first trigger. Hit unload. See, it automatically goes to the unload thing, and it's not letting me dump. Anywhere with the... So, yeah. I'm not getting the ability to dump. We'll check out that other mod. I'm going to pull this out, get this thing wrapped up. I'm sorry about that, but... We'll revisit it once I find that other snow tile mod. Nope, there's a, snow is on the ground, so uh, that is not the issue. We should be able to dump it anywhere there's snow, and it's still not letting us. The shovel works fine. So I'm just going to zap it out for now. Slasher42, thank you for the follow. So I believe I already exported it to the desktop. 
Yep. So we can put it back in if we if I figure it out in the near future. But for today, our snow melter is going to take a side road to goodbye road, and then we gotta do our snow mask, and then wrap this up. So a little bit longer. And we'll be done. But we'll look into it. But for your release today, you're getting a hole in the ground. I finished my electronic document something that was required last minute thank you so much for that link KJB Farm I'm going to click on that and open it up in my browser so I have it snow tile plant and see exactly what they're doing there so but for today, we'll just take care of what we got here and get you guys a map. Thank you for the bits, G-Man131. Look at that glass over there. You do want this thing, right? I think. We've got a couple things. They added seasons to PS4. That's a pretty cool. Did we delete it? Or did I just delete the triggers? What happened there? I deleted part of it. I just deleted the trigger part. And Steelcrafter59, welcome to the stream. Uh, we're going to do a little editing of our snow mask in just a minute once we get this hole filled in. Because this, this was a failed attempt of a snow melter. that we'll revisit in the near future. But after vacation, we got to get back to the 16X map tomorrow. That's my goal. We got lots of work to do there. We've got a lot of stuff in here today. And I'm eating a cookie. Uh, You will notice that there will be a little bald spot underneath your grass there because we're going to save that spot for later. Um, save the map. So basically, with a snow mask, it, it is in the map as a fill type that is basically taking up a spot so snow can't go there. Just like when the gravel is in the gravel pit, um, you can't, snow won't pile up on the gravel. There's actually a fill type on the road, and wherever the snow doesn't pile up, built into the map, but it's turned its visibility down to zero. So once we save this, we got to exit out. And we'll show you how to view your snow mask and edit it if you already have it in a map or if you have a map with a snow mask that you're not so happy with. It's actually a pretty easy process. It's just turning the visibility on, then opening up the editor. And you will see it everywhere. And then editing and then turning the visibility back off. So we'll do that step. We've just got to put it around a couple of the new things we put in. The water on the other side. And yeah, a couple places. It's 
once we're done saving here, maybe closing this editor for the first time in hours will help alleviate some of the lag. We've been moving around in it for nine hours now without shutting it down. So we'll close that up. So we're going to jump into my PV3 maps. And we're going to open up the map 01 i3d into Notepad++. It'll take a little while. And close all but this. All right, we're going to do a search. Find foliage sub layer. Sometimes if you have fewer, it's not as hard to find. But we got to go down to not the sub layer, just down below those. We are going to have a SS snow mask right here under this foliage sublayer and we're gonna go over to our where is it visibility setting view distance right here we're gonna put that back up to 80 and click save when we come back we just gotta change that number back to zero so we're not seeing the snow mask when we're playing the game And the snow mask gets edited just like painting any other crazy grass type thing in the map. Pretty easy. You will see it down the roads. I left it kind of jaggy. I could have cleaned up the road edges a little bit, but it's kind of cool to like see the drifts on some of the roads coming in. So I didn't mess with that too much. And we're just going to take out the few buildings underneath the few things that we put in so there's no snow piling up on them save it up again then in the show and zip this up to get it to you guys my stream health is even unstable again so things are going wacky over here I hope the upload doesn't take too long but Internet is being an issue right now as well. Yep, we're dropping frames. It's not quite going good. Dropping frames here. Although it stopped dropping them. I'm trying to refresh the stream and it went blank. All right. So now you can see the snow mask we have on here. It is just a green grassy looking thing. So we're going to go over to wherever we have something that we don't want snow to pile up on. Notice we left the road so you can plow out the dirt ones. But anywhere there's a road that's paved, there's a little bit of a snow mask on it. Uh, down to here. Oh, look at that. It was already under that cover. So the snow mask actually just needs to be edited a little bit. Let's get a square. Let's bring in 
Buh, buh, buh. Foliage layer. S S snow mask. And delete back a little bit around there. We're gonna we gotta put it on the ad brush. I'm gonna just hit here and then delete it back. Shouldn't take anything off of there. Just to clear out so no snow falls into our pit. Am I offline or am I live? It says I went offline. Who knows what's going on? Now it's trying to do video preview. Now it says I'm live and unstable. All right, so snow mask. It is just going crazy, internet. Can you guys still hear me out there? I hope so. Uh, we are so far ahead of where that stream says it is. Ba -ba -ba, we've got just a couple places to edit here to nail down this snow mask. And the next one is over here. Underneath this thing. We can kind of trim it up a little bit, maybe. And yeah, if it overlaps a little, we're okay. But I am lagging terribly. And my connection went back to unstable. So we're going to just wrap this up. And I'm sorry if you guys can't hear me or see any of this but we got to get her finished and we can always show you the snow mask tomorrow Finish up. I'm typing new guys a message. So, I don't know if you guys will be able to see me edit that snow mask with this video quality being as bad as it is. And we're dropping frames again. It's just been up and down today, so we're going to finish it up. I don't know if you can hear me. But we'll... Uh, Finish this mess up. I don't even think my message... Yeah, it made it out there. So I'm going to go offline and get this uh, set up once I put the stuff back to normal. Oh, it's okay now? Well, you might be way behind because it's crazy. Yeah, it went back to excellent. So basically, I don't know how much you guys missed because... My It's my internet connection just going way up and way back down, but we're finishing up. You could see, if you missed it, I just painted the snow mask 
around these so that the snow won't fall on that area and get inside. I did that to all the things. It's basically another fill type, uh, another crop type, and it's planted there so nothing else can, the snow won't go there. So with that, uh, we're just saving. And then we'll turn the view distance back off. I don't know how far you missed. So you can see I have in the foliage layer SS Snow Mask turned on. I just painted it just like that around wherever I want it. And you can see everywhere on the map, like there's some around the garages so snow doesn't fall inside. Once that's all in place, we just go to exit because we already saved. Uh, and this, yeah, the upload might take a while, so we're going to close down that. And to finish up with this, we're going to go back one folder, delete this PV3 1.49 gigabyte zip file it's going to be 1.5 something with the new additions most likely add to archive now i don't know if you guys know this as well before i do this inner maps when you're running this it creates these three cache files here and you don't actually have to have those when you zip your map and it'll make it a little bit smaller i did that test a while ago i said it just uh, it'll recreate them once the person puts it on their system. So add to my archive zip quality best. We'll zip it up and let you know what size this is going to be. And then I'm gonna shut down this stream do the upload give me a little time i'm gonna grab something to eat while the first upload's going up there then we'll set up come back down here and we'll nail this down and hopefully we'll get to see you i'm probably not going to come back today been a long day but i'll be back tomorrow and we'll check on you guys so give it a little time it's going to probably be at least an hour to an hour and a half um i did one thing that I forgot to do as usual so uh, can I cancel that please yeah before I get too far let's try that again one thing I always forget and you guys know it is the version number we want it to say 3.4 now so people you'll know what version you're on all right now we'll try it <laughs> And with that, I'm going to shut down the stream. I thank everybody for bearing with me as we add some more cool things here. While that's zipping, we're going to roll the credits. Unless you guys want to know the file size. I guess we'll let it finish up. I'll give you the file size so you can make sure you have room. <laughs> Live and not stable <laughs> sums you up. <laughs> Same here. Uh, so we'll zip it up. It's going to take a little bit. We've increased the file size. I could technically pull the snow melting facility. No, I can't. Didn't take much extra graphics because we just copied the uh, water one. So yeah, that wouldn't save anything. Can't delete those files. Everything for that one was already in the map. But we will have some a little bit larger file size. And more work to do. But this should satisfy some of you for a little while, hopefully. I've got lots more ideas we can do. I will look at that water thing. And then... uh. Follow it up. Yeah, Sapper509, good night to you as well. We're going to give you... Actually, my computer's running pretty slow. It doesn't take this long to zip a file, usually. I think I just have way too much stuff going today without reloading and 
things are going to crap around here. So before I actually start my upload, when I log off here, I'm going to do a reboot. See if we can get things back a little closer to normal. We're at 58%. And climbing. Yep, I will be putting this as well as my Seasons Geo file, which will be in the same folder. And that will set all the settings so that the crops will work correctly and everything will be plantable and harvestable. And we had changed the seasons a little bit, so there's a little bit more uh, snow on the ground in the winters. It can pile up pretty high. Added a little bit more of the, just a little bit more than the standard amount to, for precipitation in the winter time, and a tiny bit more in the spring, so your soil should be nice and moist. I don't know if that affects anything, but not a lot in the spring. But you'll get some rainy period, a little bit more precipitation in those two seasons with a summer being the same and the temperatures have all been adjusted to New York you're gonna want the 1.2 version of the seasons mod that's what we've been using that's the one that has all of these uh, the latest version 1.2 I think it is that's what has all the capabilities of the switchers turning on and off the ice and all that stuff so grab up 1.2 of the seasons mod which, if you're already using the one that I uploaded with the map before, that will be completely fine. So our file size is bigger, but it's 2.18 gigs. Uh, we're going to give you this tonight. It did ju definitely jump up, but I will have to go through and uh, knock some of that file sizes down and stuff like that. It would be cool if you could make a snow mask on your drive. You can make a snow mask anywhere you want. Uh, but we're not going to do that right now. So basically, I'm going to just put it into my Dropbox. In We have an in-progress folder right here that I do my uploads to. And then I copy it over into all your Dropbox folders and everything else. And I will, in the next update, we'll bring that file size down. That'll be the concentration. We'll just try to get that snow thing working. But we're going to wait till after my vacation to get that. We're going to work on the PV17 V3 thing right now. It can't even sync my Dropbox. Come on. It will. uploading two files so that will be in progress so thanks everybody for watching let's see if we can at least roll the credits here today and we'll catch you back here tomorrow and we'll see how everything goes with that for you guys to mess with i also gotta yeah before i forget let me get my uh seasons mod which is in my pv3 the latest actually it's also in uh da -da -da, rm seasons no where did i put it fs17 geo pv3 dot zip there we go we're gonna need to get that to you guys as well and i'm gonna log off so we get some bandwidth back because it still has not synchronized all right two files says 17 minutes, but that ain't right because it's usually like 57 minutes. Although the geo, what do they just give me a crap load of bandwidth after all that 
now it's that's more like it. One hour left on my upload of PV15 V3, just the upload to the first link. So let's roll the credits. Thanks everybody for watching. We'll catch you back here tomorrow and we'll work on the 16x map and check out how everything's working for you guys. So we'll catch you all later. Thanks everybody for your donations, your bits, your kindness, and your putting up with me. We'll catch you all later. And while we're still rolling the credits, I just want to thank everybody else once again because we restarted the stream several times. A lot of names got off the list. Too bad I was expecting a real long list. But yeah, good night, everybody. We'll catch you all tomorrow. Have a great evening. <laughs>